Good morning, everyone, from Disney's California Adventure, day two, part two. Yes, we are in Avengers Campus this morning. We are going to be at the Pim Test Kitchen, eating the big and the small foods with the Pim particles, and we are so excited. This is your biggest, like, must do, must eat. So we are doing this first thing today. It is 1045. So our window for mobile order just opened and we ordered a ton of things to try for you guys. And for are, you, us. <laughs> are you ready? I'm ready. I'm super excited. Yes. Let's do it. Yeah. So I know I showed this in the other video, but it's showing off the sign again. PIM, PYM Test Kitchen. And you have Impossible Julia is um, not able to eat the impossible, but um, that's what they have in Disney World, unfortunately. I'm not even able to eat the impossible. But you can eat the possible. <laughs> Some other people are out over here. Captain America. I, I don't know who that is. I'm so sorry. Very fun. All right, so we got this giant pretzel. It comes with a beer cheese. Brandon got this giant chicken sandwich at the teeny tiny little bun, which is hysterical. And it comes with tater tots. I got this Caesar salad with a Parmesan crisp and a giant crouton. And of course, we had to get the Choco Smash candy bar, which is absolutely massive. Like, here's my hand for reference. This is really, really big. Really big. And Brandon also got more of the soda because he loved it so much that he's just filling it up. We had to get a big table because, well, lots of food. All right, Brandon's gonna dig into his not so little chicken sandwich. How do you even eat that? <laughs> you know when you're eating a burger? Yeah. And you eat like all the bread around, but the meat's still there. That's what it reminds me of. How is it? That sauce is amazing. What is the sauce? It doesn't say on the on the app or anything. It doesn't, but um, that sauce is really good. What? Should I just like eat the bun by itself? I mean, if you want to, I feel like, I need, like a, it's like a chicken parm kind of. It doesn't feel very logical to eat that as a sandwich. As a sandwich. No. And you still like your soda as much as you did the other day? Is it still like vanilla and Sprite and like Sierra Mist and Mountain Dew and? It's like Inca Cola. It is not like Inca Cola. Okay, I'm gonna try the pretzel next. Okay, you like the sandwich though? Oh, I love the sandwich. You'd get it again? 10 out of 10. It's like a basic um, pretzel. Uh huh. But it's just oversized. Okay. It's really soft. How's the beer cheese? It's alright. We've had better. Is the pretzel as good as the one at um, the, I'm forgetting the name, but the place at Hollywood Studios that has the really good pretzel? Really? It's better over there. Oh, darn. That's my opinion. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I'm, not, I'm not a fan of the, the cheese. Oh, no. Yeah, I feel like the mustard's better. How are the tater tots with the chicken sandwich? They're good. They're Nothing. like seasoned. Nothing like like overly brave. Yeah, they're still good. Oh, they're doing a sun show over here. show Brandon was able to get his chicken sandwich down to a slider so it looks normal now proud of you I'm impressed with this okay I'm gonna try
try, try the pretzel now. Now that the sun shows over. And Black Widow and Black Panther got the vibranium back, so no worries. Okay. Let's try it with the cheese. Mm. I don't like the cheese. See, I told you. It's like rainy. It's not good. And I love beer cheese. So I know good beer cheese when I see it this time. The pretzel's good though. Why don't you try with mustard and see if you like it better with the mustard? It's better with the mustard, right? Now for my salad. It has little croutons and a giant crouton. And it has like big parmesan pieces. And it has olives and, <laughs> and onions. Brandon always laughs at me when I get salad like this. But I like it. It's a little annoying to have to cut your own salad, but I think it tastes good. Is that uranium? It's like cheesy garlic bread. What? Is that uranium? Uranium? <laughs> what? <laughs> Show me the center. It's blue. And it has like parmesan. It's pretty good. And then... It tastes like Caesar salad. It's a winner. I mean, it's Caesar salad. It's nothing crazy. It's exactly what I would expect. Brandon is trying to do the, the pretzel, it's just so big. Was the purpose of pin particles still a little unclear? With the food to try to solve world hunger? Unclear. I'm pulling it apart. Ooh. Yay. I want to point out that this says bite size. Right there. It says bite size. This is more than several bites, but apparently the ingredients are uh, caramel, nougat, peanuts, chocolate, brownie, and dark chocolate. Does it have peanut butter? It does. No, it has peanuts, not peanut butter. Okay. What are you thinking? I'm ready. Oh, I thought you ate it already. No, I just had some chocolate that was on the floor. Alright, go ahead. This is like enough, I feel like. <laughs> ah. Oh wow. This is so good. This is like if every candy bar plus a brownie got married, this is what it tastes like. You heard it here first, folks. <laughs> He's just gonna bite it. Isn't it so good? It's very good. It's very chewy. But it's very good. There's no way someone can eat that one sip. I don't no think way. so. No way. We're gonna see if they have a box. I would recommend this to a friend for sure. I think my favorite part is um, is the caramel one here. You think? I like the brownie part too. You know, the brownie is like a basic brownie. I think the caramel is what does it. Yeah. That's my opinion. So if it was just the caramel, you'd like it just as much? I can't do without <laughs> the brownie. I can't do it without the caramel. Interesting. Okay. Hot take. All right. Overall thoughts on the uh, PIM test kitchen. That was really fun. I'm really glad we went. I think that overall, like, that was my least favorite place that we ate at this whole trip, um, personally. But the chocolate bar almost made up for all of it. Like, that was so delicious. We were able to get a box, so that's good to know that they have boxes here because the food is so huge. There's no way that you're you're gonna finish that unless you have unless like you have a big party. Yeah. Or if you really, really, really like. Chocolate. It's like it, it's like the test kitchen, not the um, test kitchen. This the, is the, 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 the 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 sink, test the, 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 the sink the kitchen. kitchen. Sink. Yeah, I can't speak during this entire it's trip. Hard. Things are hard. I'm exhausted. But, but it was really fun, like for the novelty of it and everything. So 
I would recommend going for the fun, but the food I thought was just like fun. What about you though, since this was like your most anticipated thing? All right, so I had a different opinion than you, right? So because you were only able to eat like lettuce, right? It wasn't as fun and exciting yeah. in your mouth, you know? <laughs> my chicken sandwich was amazing, I loved yeah. it. The breading on the chicken was awesome. The, the bun, the, the brioche bun, yeah, uh, was crunchy. So it was toasted. I wish it wasn't toasted, but it was still amazing. Um, I loved the, the pretzel. It was. Um, I mean, it's a basic pretzel, but the, the size of it, the fun of it, uh, it was just amazing. I loved it all. I liked your tots. Your tots were really good. I thought the tots were basic. Really? I thought the tots had like actual seasoning on them for once. Nah. I mean, I've had better tots before, but. Again, they were great, still enjoyed it, and um, I would come here again, honestly. Yeah? Cool. All right, so there you have it. That was our experience at the Pim Testing Kitchen. It was fun.